Ovarian drilling is a classical procedure that was done in, earlier in the treatment of uh, PCOS. It was felt that these little eggs that were building up in the ovary were somehow not being able to be released. And so it was thought that by punching holes in these cysts that it would help them to release and make the ovary more able to ovulate. And in fact, PCOS is a metabolic or endocrine problem and that by doing the drilling, it actually did make the hormones better. It did lower the testosterone level and make the ovary more sensitive to ovulation, only transiently. It will only work for a few months and then as the vicious cycle gets worse again, it goes back to the normal levels. And so there were pregnancies that occurred and we did use this procedure in people that were not able to ovulate on Clomid. Um, since metformin has come along, we haven't used ovarian drilling as much, although I hear that there is somewhat of a resurgence of it again. Uh, the main problem with ovarian drilling is that it can cause, uh, well, it has to be done surgically. So it is, uh, you are put to sleep, you have to have a tube put in through your belly button so that we can look inside and do the ovarian drilling. And then um, there can be scar tissue that is formed on the ovaries from the procedure itself, causing more issues and making it harder to get pregnant in the future.